Would you like to expand your skill set as a craftsman and creator? Well, we would like to help. Each episode will be focusing in on a specific technique in blacksmithing, knife making, and beyond that will give you the edge in your work. This is your edge. Welcome to the very first episode of Your Edge, a show where you learn some of the basic yet absolutely necessary crafting techniques. We're going to begin with the penny scroll. The penny scroll is ubiquitous architectural smithing technique as well as present in home decoration. Here at Baltimore Knife & Sword we use it for our guards. Being simple enough, it is fairly tricky. The key to a good penny scroll is this little tuck in here and you can almost place a penny on top of the scroll itself. A penny scroll that does not have this tuck in and is not round is not a very good penny scroll. Let's begin. The first thing you do is you use the corner of the anvil and make a cube. The material behind the cube swells, so you flatten it and taper it. After that, the cube turns into a square. You take that square and move to the side of the anvil to make something similar to Eye of the Cat. After that, you roll the Eye of the Cat in on the tapered portion and hit the point. That way, the eye turns into a circle. Now that we practice on a piece of half by half, this can be turned into a coat hanger. Let's move on to some sword guards. Notice I'm moving to the sharpest corner of the anvil and start wobbling. That technique helps creating that little tuck in visually on the sides. You don't have to practice that at this stage yet, but later on it will give you the edge you need. Let's take a look at this entire process from another angle.
So, this was the penny scroll. Now, this procedure requires a lot of repetition, and before you move on to sword guards, you need to practice a lot. The reason is, the scrolls have to be fairly symmetrical. Now, from here on, once you master it, you can move on to something a little bit more complicated, and that is the leaf. Same guard, and you can see how it starts out with a penny scroll, but that is much later. If you found this video helpful, please click the like button, give us a thumbs up. If there's any specific technique you would like to see next, leave us a comment below. Please subscribe to That Works and keep honing your edge.